Sorry. We just got some more new books. Imagine. Okay. Oh, this, is good. Oh, just oh, this one's teeny tiny, but I understand there was a TED talk related to this. We should all be feminists. You can come and check it out. Another one of those books that was the first in a series that disappeared and needed to be replaced. <laughs> the boy in the black suit. Okay. I know someone who'll be excited about this. Shadowway. The silence of six? That sounds ominous. That's what I'm saying. Oh, this okay. came in there too. I don't know what that is. <laughs> this <laughs> also came in there. We don't, we don't know what that is. Package. I think this was on one an award list that I read. Um, the description down here says Breaking Bad meets City of God. It is the astonishing story of an ordinary man forced to make a decision that would turn his world upside down. <laughs> we have the uh, Reese Malcolm list and Pokemon multiple yeah. Yes. Okay. This author, I love her. Um, she wrote In the Shadow of Blackbirds and another book whose name, of course, I can't remember right now, but they were both good and they were both historical fiction. This one is a reimagining of Shakespeare's Hamlet set in the 1920s. So, sounds interesting. I'm going to read it, of course. I did a book talk on Into the Dim, time travel, super, super good story. This one is all over social media right here, 2000's Gods Above You. And tarnished. Yes, that's the sequel to Perfected, in which people are raised to be pets for other people. It sounds oh. weird. Um, I talked about this one in a book talk. It's one of those star-crossed love stories um, with some magical realism. It was really, 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 really good. <laughs> it was, oh, Winner's Kiss! The last oh, yes. of the trilogy, The Winner's Curse. Yes, book. Third way. books in trilogies are always super exciting. This book, this was part of the Hub Challenge. It was, it got an award or was on an award list. Um, this is a book about a, a mentally ill individual who believes that he is Calvin from Calvin and Hobbes. Oh, nice, nice. Uh, there's another affordable children's book and Things We Know by Jessica Kirby. How to Be Brave and Yet Be Brave, yes, but super good. Ooh, ooh. I think I might have even done a book talk on it. Okay. And this one, I believe this one is Space Pirates, so I'll be reading that. Space Pirates, you gotta do that. And All American Boys. And is this the last one? I think so. Okay. And lastly, this is um, episode, or issue number two of the Unbeatable Squirrel Girl. Hilarious. We have number one already, and here's number two. And see you later.